It's that time of year again for the Trojans men's hockey team. The playoffs have arrived. The Trojans finished the season tops in the ACAC division, but the Trojans closed out their regular season with two tough losses to the Concordia Thunder. Trojans goaltender Reese St. Goddard says the team came out flat. A uh, tough weekend. I mean, uh, we kind of just we got outplayed and uh, they deserve the four points. The Trojans do have a bye week to work out all the kinks in their system, and head coach Ken Babby has nothing but high expectations. Everybody has to remember, too, that there was 15 first-year players on this team in the sense that they haven't been to SAIT before, and, you know, we have a different expectation. And over the years, SAIT's been the target of every team coming in to play us, and so we're the targets again. You're the benchmark. And sometimes as a, as a new player, it's hard to understand that you've got to have your A game on all the time because other teams are coming with their A game. In order to succeed at this year's playoffs, Captain Blair Gray says the Trojans just need to stick to the basics. Not a whole lot of changes, just uh, sticking to the game plan and making sure we don't get away from the game plan. Uh, we like to get the pucks in deep and start uh, crashing and banging, which is a really big part of our game. And I thought we got away from that in the first period at home. So I think we need to do that in uh, every period and we'll be fine. With 15 rookies taking their first shot at the playoffs, this could be the toughest championship run yet for the Trojans. The Trojans are still the team to beat in the playoffs, having won two straight ACAC titles and three out of the last four championships. Can they go for a three-peat? We'll find out soon enough. For News File Sports, I'm Gino DiPaoli.